So this is a three level three level bio incubator, and we've got a bio filtered grow media on the upper level that is filtering out organic solids and ammonia from the biomass tea that we've added to these tea bags and we make up a special blend containing different sources of biomass, weeds, greens, leaves, foods, and so on that have, um, they contribute different levels of nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium, and all the different trace elements and macromolecules. So we're doing that for lettuces and tomatoes and all plants in between, basically, um, plus some extra mineral boosting blends that we're coming up with, but nonetheless, these are pretty comprehensive, and they do a great job, and this is something we're going to be offering uh, to growers that want to that want to practice this form of organic hydroponics, or as uh, we like to refer to it, bioponics. Bioponics is different than hydroponics. Even if you call it organic, because we don't really, I don't, we don't espouse to anything that is chemical or, you know, for that matter, processed or mined before it uh, goes into the system. And it's, uh, and we're creating a living ecosystem, not, not a sterile eco uh, environment, which is pretty much tantamount to what is hydroponic. Nonetheless, we're in a soilless system. We just happen to have created it with this three-level concept that we sort of developed at Bioponica and uh, and that's what you're seeing here. So this is a bio incubator and you can see a lot of the, the organics in the water after having added our bio tea and there's it's not stressing out the fish there's there's a bunch of goldfish in there but they're okay with it it's not too much ammonia it's more of the organics uh, ammonias are getting taken care of by microorganisms that live in the beds, and the beds are pretty mature. And they're, they're, it's, it's, as it warms up, everything sort of picks up at the same speed. We're getting more extraction from the tea bags, and then we're getting more, more bacteria decomposing the organics and the ammonias that come out of those tea bags, just simultaneously, just because they're sort of working on the same temperature. Um, and you know heating up as the weather warms up so that's it uh, just a little demonstration just the, what we're doing with the little vortex and the uh, funnel is creating uh, a, a, a vortex of water movement um, uh, based on the on the work of Victor Schauberger and many who have followed his uh, his his interest in, in uh, the molecular restructuring and the properties of, of uh, vortex uh, water currents and water energy. So more on that later. Uh, that's uh, uh, that's all I really wanted to share with you today. Thanks for watching.